Welcome back to another video. This is Andrew, the CEO of Quantata. In today's video, we'll be going over how you can tell if order flow is bullish or bearish using the bid and ask. In today's video, we'll be going over what the bid and ask is, what the bid and ask spread is, how you can see the bid and ask uh, on individual orders on the Quantata platform, as well as whether or not order flow has a bullish or bearish thesis. So what is the bid and ask? The bid is the highest price that a seller is willing to buy a security at. The ask, also known as the offer, is the lowest price that a seller is willing to sell a security at. What is the bid ask spread? The bid ask spread refers to the difference between the bid and the ask. The spread is the difference between the highest price that the buyer is willing to pay for a security and the lowest price that a seller is willing to sell a security at. The bid ask spread can be used as a measure of the supply and demand of a security. The further these bid and ask prices diverge, the more the supply and demand of the security changes. An example is when an investor initiates a trade, they'll accept one of the prices depending on whether they are buying the security at the ask or selling the security at the bid. The bid and ask on the quant data platform. So in a second, we'll, we'll go ahead and switch over to the quant data platform to show you where the bid and ask is on the quant data platform to show you what the abbreviations on the platform mean. So let's go ahead and switch over to dashboard. This is the main dashboard of the quant data platform. And on this dashboard, you'll see the options order flow feed. And in the options order flow feed, you'll see we have a column that says size at price. In this column, we have a designation of what side the trade executed on. So you'll see that we'll have a little letter that denotes whether or not it executes on the bid or ask side. So the A is ask side. When you see a double A, it means it executed above the ask. And we also can filter in mid-market trades, so trades that uh, executed in between the bid and the ask. And then we could also include bid and below bid trades, which we'll just show as B or double B. So we'll go ahead and move back to the slideshow and continue on with it. Does order flow have a bullish or bearish thesis? So how can we tell if an order is bullish or bearish using the bid or ask information that is provided? In its simplest form, a call is a bet that the security will go up and a put is a bet that the security will go down. However, if an institution is closing a call position, that institution is getting rid of their call position, most likely because they, they do not think that the call will continue to go up. The same applies to puts. So how can we gauge whether the order flow is bullish or bearish if both calls and puts can have a bullish or bearish thesis depending on what action is being taken? We can use the price in relation to the bid and the ask to make a prediction about what side of the trade the institution was on. For example, a trade consisting of calls executed on the ask price or on the ask side would hold a bullish thesis because we can predict that the trader is purchasing those calls. This same logic can be applied to an example of puts on the ask side. If puts are executed on the ask side, it holds a bearish thesis because we can predict that the trader is purchasing those puts. Conversely, trades that execute on the bid side are the inverse as demonstrated in the table below. As we see here, calls on the ask side are being purchased and calls on the bid side are being sold, which would indicate whether we have a bullish or bearish thesis. The same applies to puts, except it's the inverse. Puts on the ask side are purchased, which indicates a bearish scenario, whereas puts on the bid side are sold, which indicates a bullish scenario. Thank you for watching. That is one of the ways that we can use the information provided on the Quant Data platform to help you decide whether or not an order is bullish or bearish. 
There's other indications we can use that I'll make videos on in the future, so make sure you subscribe and look for any new videos that come out. And don't forget to sign up to a free seven day trial. The link will be in the description for the trial. Also attached below will be a link on an article about the bid to ask spread and determining how you can tell if an order is bullish or bearish using the bid and ask spread. So feel free to check that out.